vegetables are because Childhood obesity is a serious concern in our nation as it is in New York State and in our county. My name is Laura Rundell. I'm the assistant principal here at Clyde Savannah Elementary, and I have also been working as the wellness coordinator for the past three years. We know that if students are obese in childhood, they're much more likely to be obese in adulthood. That can lead to things like heart disease, diabetes, different cancers. So Catch is a way to help improve those health outcomes and to really combat it early through programming and education. Hi, I'm Justine Cobb. I'm the Senior Nutritionist with Finger Lakes Eat Smart New York at Cornell Cooperative Extension. CATCH stands for a Coordinated Approach to Child Health, and it is a school-building-wide initiative to create a healthy environment. When healthy food choices and physical activity are integrated into the school, healthy behaviors follow. Through Finger Lakes Eat Smart New York, a SNAP-Ed program, we train school teams and then help schools integrate CATCH into their daily teaching and activities. We work with schools throughout the Finger Lakes region, all of which have 50% or more students receiving free or reduced meals. These schools are in rural communities like Clyde and in urban communities such as Hendy Elementary School in Elmira. A catch message for today. Drinking water throughout the day can help keep us focused by reducing tiredness and headaches. Our brain is made up of about 75% water, so stay hydrated and keep your brain running well today. Great advice. I'm Karina Forsyth. I teach fifth grade here at Hendy Elementary School and I'm the catch champion for our school. Students perform better educationally and socially behaviorally if they are well nourished and hydrated. Their brain actually functions much better if they have proper nutrition and proper hydration. They aren't thinking about being hungry. They are excited to get up and be physically fit in the classroom and participate with others. What's really nice about it is we have catch in very different aspects of the school. Um, it was presented in gym class with Mr. Stuckey. Not many slow foods and hardly any woes at all. My dynamic diet people, go stand over there by our, our posters. Strawberry, kiwi, <laughs> orange. In the cafeteria, we have posters and healthy options. In the after school program, Mr. Whitfield encouraged students to use pedometers to track their, their mileage in walking, which is, which is fantastic. My name is Sid Whitfield. I'm a one-on-one -on -one aide in special education. Oh, I'm on the catch committee, and we were trying to come up with ways that we could get the kids involved with so physical activity. Mr. Stuckey, our PE teacher, he suggested that um, maybe we could do something with the pedometers that we have. Have the kids track their steps while they're in school and see how far they can go. And, you know, the kids, they were competing. They have fun doing it. And, um, you know, it's, I can't wait to get it started again next year. Well, I like the walk challenge because you could eat healthy breakfast. It's fun for everybody to do. And you get lots and lots of exercise. What I like best about the walking challenge is you can exercise, you eat healthy food, and it's fun for everybody. My name is Donna Ravello and I am the Food Service Director for the Clyde Savannah School District. So we've been able to bring the CATCH program into the cafeteria by incorporating different foods and different instructions throughout the cafeteria that the kids are actually learning in the classroom. We try to push the fruits and the vegetables as much as possible, trying to make them the center of the plate instead of the protein or the grains. Their response has been really positive. My favorite gold food is grapes, strawberries, cucumbers, beets, watermelon, eggplant, carrots, broccoli, watermelon, broccoli, apples, squirrels, grapes, watermelon, black bean, carrots. My name is Sarah Marcatel. I have two students at Clyde Savannah involved in the CATCH program. I have a sixth grader and I have a second grader. It's very, very helpful to see the healthy eating habits that we're trying to instill at home reinforced in the school. Just because unhealthy food is so readily available in today's world that, and our lives are so busy and between running between different events and sporting things, it's almost impossible for us to really, just on our own, make these healthy food choices. So it's really nice to see the strategies and skills they've been taught through CATCH. 
A lot of these students are very technologically advanced. And with technology, a lot of the times they, they become sedentary. They, and to teach them to pick the healthier option, it's a great program to encourage them to be independent and make their own responsible choices. I think the CATCH program at the elementary level is very important because this is where all foundational skills are really forming. So helping students understand the value of good nutrition and being active for their life is a great way to set the course for their future. I'm Katie Lum. I'm the principal of Clyde Savannah Elementary School. If I were speaking to other school districts, I would tell them that we can't afford not to be a part of this program. We owe it to our students to help them build a healthy life before we can even begin to tackle academics. Finger Lakes Eat Smart New York was instrumental in helping us kick this off last year. They actually came in and taught the lessons for us and helped it become part of our culture and what we expect to the point where now our teachers are able to do it because it's such a part of who we are. So some people might wonder how we add one more thing into our day and I would argue that it's not one more thing, it is the thing. It is the most important thing we do to have healthy kids. The Clyde Savannah and Hendy Elementary Schools are two of the wonderful examples of how communities can implement CATCH. These school successes come from a team effort which includes school administrators, teachers, parents, support staff, and Finger Lakes Eat Smart New York nutritionists. The challenges with childhood obesity are many, but with coordinated efforts like the CATCH program, solutions are within reach.